<laughs> What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the oh, yeah, yeah. Welcome back to reality, <laughs> the real reality or whatever. Period. Period. I am your host, Pharaoh, where Doran by one of calls Lee. These episodes don't need to be 90 minutes. They need to be got to 45, but no shade. Lee, how you feeling about the episode? I mean, it's no shade at all, but you no you said what needs to be said. No shade at all. But it's because this this season was created to just be 45 minute episodes. Mm-hmm. Our episode, and then they they've been extending them to be these hour. But honestly, now that I'm thinking about it, if it came out the time it was produced and it was only an hour, I wouldn't be feeling so eh, about it. I feel because when they're trying to extend it and create things that don't exist and and add extra layers to the stuff, and I'm not feeling I'm not feeling the episodes that much. No shade, but hey, we're here. We're here. We're here. We are here. And that's all that matters. <laughs> and that's all that matters. So they start off with this random scene, clearly created because they were missing out. No shade. But they get to paraglide. My thing is, this should have been a challenge. But it was. They have to paraglide. It was just for fun. We got to see them paraglide. It was beautiful. Over Colombia. It was very beautiful. Colombia? In, in Colombia. It was very, very, very beautiful there. So I'll give them that. Um, We see that they go to their first clue and we're starting off group by group the first group is caesar ricky and amber and Vinny because they were leaving first um and we see with the second group juan and shane juan says this is his first city the second group leaves and then after that the third group leaves so they're all leaving in 15 minutes whatever they're doing boom when we start off you got to go to the escalators and you got to find your clue people were struggling uh-huh. to the escalators but we got there and we got to the d and honestly like, I can definitely see how like the pressure of just the environment would really get to me because it was a lot of people in that little area. Like y'all need what? to move. Vamos, 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 rapido. Episode actually because at the uh, roadblock, somebody was just laying on the damn thing on the thing they had to look at. Yeah, people move, were baby. everywhere. You gotta get up. You gotta get up. Vamos, vamos. <laughs> it was a very crowded. Wait, man, I would be using all place. three years of my high school Spanish for for this leg. Like, like, I baby, right. I gotta, come on, come on. <laughs> but uh, no, honestly, it was a lot of people it, it, randomly because now that I'm thinking about it, these last two seasons, it's never been this amount of people. Maybe that's how it is in Colombia, but it's just it was a lot of people this whole episode. I will say. So, I think it get, definitely helps with like you know looking for directions and things like that. But they haven't had any like self driving legs. I really wanted to see that. I think those will probably be a little bit more interesting too because like they've mm-hmm. been in taxis and on foot a lot. Like, I kind of want to see them navigate themselves. They'll do it next episode, according to the next time we see the clip of Letitia and Rod. And Letitia was like, well, you in the back yelling at me. Because <laughs> that's always the fun. That's always fun, watching them, like, navigate on their own. Mm-hmm. Especially in this type of season where there isn't flights um, and stuff like that, where everything's so structured because of the COVID. It's right. definitely the best. The best legs are the ones where they're self-driving, um, for sure. So, boom, we get to the detour. And, Lee, the detour is... Uh, Y'all, Lee would have had us up. The, the, the detour debate. was dance, vibe, or wall, scribe. You either got to learn this break dance, this 30 second break dance, or okay. you have to figure out a rebus puzzle on this mural that's across this. Wall. And, and Lee initially, said, initially, I was like, okay, me and okay, this is the reality king team. We out there. I was like, Pharaoh, we got to dance because I'm just thinking puzzle. My immediate thought was puzzle <laughs> memorization. Mm-mm. Even though dancing is a form of memorization, I was like, clearly this wall scribe is going to be too much. Mm-hmm. But it, it does had to get me together real quick. It did sound too much, but I I'm good at puzzles. I like puzzles, and my whole thought process was dancing when I was a kid. Me and my cousin, we would learn all them Disney Channel Zendaya. Bella Thorne, we would literally be trying to learn those dances. And when I tell you, learning a dance is not easy. And then actually getting every single step. Because honestly, yeah. when they were checking them, 
if you didn't get one step right, you got to know. So it's like mm-hmm. you have to get every single step. And it's a 30 seconds dance. 30 seconds doesn't sound long, but 30 seconds dancing. Hold your breath for 30 seconds. You tired, bitch. I'm so, just thinking like I uh, learned the Soldier Boy. I learned the Kang Wang with it. I know these line dances. You know, I can okay. pop, lock, and drop it. You know, I'm thinking I could do a little jig. And then they said break dance. And when I thought, break, because, you know, no. you don't, when you're thinking, you don't see it. But it did say break dance. So what I said to Lee was, I don't think we're going to be able to learn to dance. And Lee was like, I mean, I think that's the better option. And I was like, do you feel like you could, you could learn this dance? A break dance in, in 30 do seconds. Do you feel like you could, do you genuinely feel confident that you could learn this dance? Because if you don't, I feel like we should try the uh, puzzle. And then if it seems hard, We'll switch detours, and I feel like that'll be a better way for us to get it going. And Loki, that would have ate because, because girl, honestly, I think this is one of those detours where like it was kind of unfair a little bit. That's yeah. why we got like such a shift in the uh placement ranking. Like yeah, we were literally saying last episode, we would like a big shift, so I really enjoyed that. But I think the biggest thing was because the wall scribe was easy as fuck. Like yeah. that was not really anything. Where some the people, dance... Don't say easy because some people didn't feel that way. Okay, you're <laughs> right. The wall scribe seemed like it would be easier to me. <laughs> Whereas the break dance is very intricate. But I think honestly, looking at the how the placement switched up, I think it's because of that detour. Like if you chose yeah. that one, you were definitely going to stay towards the earlier side of the pack. Yeah, definitely. Um, and we would have been good because uh, Farrah would have uh, punked me into choosing that. I was like, here let me. Punked you is crazy. Because I, I would, I, I, I really would not have the confidence to do the dance, but I'm just thinking like puzzle. Mm-hmm. Like the word puzzle scares me. I don't want to do no type of puzzle, none of that. I will say, now that I'm visually looking at the placements, the only thing that changed from last round was Angie and Danny getting third. Because these other every other team in the top five was in the top five last time, except Angie and Danny. But even but Walla, Angie Walla and Danny, that, yeah, really? Walla Walla getting top three, that's not something that seemed like it was even possible. So that's still a big shift. Like this top three, except season, Sethar and Ricky ain't getting God, mind Sethar you. and Ricky is on bitches' necks, and it's not even close. They're not getting God. But Amber and Vinny and Danny and Angie, they were nowhere to be found two rounds ago, I will say. So now right. it's, it's a different different type of energy. It's like, okay, hold on. I don't now. like how low Derek and Shalissa fell this episode. My my grandparents right. got to get together. Okay. Don't don't they? Uh, I need them to bump up right above Amber and Vinny next and time. Then, Go back and then Kishore and second to last. Is they finna be out next? <laughs> They're why? starting Look last. Look at this. Round. All of the women, women tri- uh, tribes, teams are at the <laughs> bottom. Like, I don't oh, like this. Oh, Lord. Uh, Damn, that did Especially happen. for Charisma and Kishori. Like, I can't lose my sisters next. If they go home next, y'all, the season is over. I don't think they will. Yes, I do. I'm rooting for them, though. <laughs> I, I hope I, I do. I really just hope they don't. So, I'm holding out faith because I love them. Them is my sisters, for real. If one of the, uh, if the, of the three bottom teams, of the three bottom teams, and it's no shade. Charisma and Kishori, the last ones I want to go home. The other two, you know, y'all cute or whatever. <laughs> okay, or whatever. So, anyways, they get to the wall scribe. Cesar and Vinny pick wall scribe, and so do Amber. Cesar and Vinny. Cesar and Ricky, and so do Amber and Vinny. Mm-hmm. So, they're all looking at the wall, and the first clue is th plus. So it's the letters th and plus. I'm like, okay, Lee, wait. That seems simple. The next <laughs> one, okay. The next one is the letter e. So it's like. TH plus the letter E, the. And then the next clue, it's a picture of Earth. So I was like, okay, world, the, the world. world. Then it was a picture of some skis, and it said minus SK. So that's is. I was confused for a minute. I ain't gonna lie. The <laughs> world. Is, but that's the thing. I, and this is why it's good that we have different qualities because I do puzzles for fun, like Danny. Like I'm a nerd a little bit. So I literally play Sudoku when I'm on break at work or I'll play chess for fun. Period, period, so period. like my brain, like I do that brain shit. They have this new game on um, the New York times. I don't know if it's Ooh. new actually, but they have a New York times called uh, connections. And so what it is, is it's 12 or eight, 12, 16. It's 16 random words. 
and you have to click the four that have the best connection to each other and you have to keep doing that until you collect all four different groupings it's so interesting so, so sometimes we should play the amazing race absolutely not that's okay. not what I'm saying. I'm saying y'all should play Connections on New York Times. It's so fun. But anyways, I always do them brain buster <laughs> boop, 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 puzzles. So I'm going to eat this up. The skis, I ate that. So the world is, the next, it's a rat, which would, I guess tried to throw them off. But it's that a rat with a, ma- with a magnifying glass. And then the magnifying glass is like shrinking in on the rat. So I'm like, okay, the world is, um, the world is, and then I didn't really know that one. I'm not going to lie. They started saying it. So I was like, oh, okay, y'all eating that up. The next one was a T and a hand. And I was like, okay, vand, vand, or something like that. And then the next one was a mirror of yourself. And then the next one was a man thinking. So it ended up being the world is bigger or smaller than you think. And I was like, okay, that's a common phrase. It's either the world is bigger than you think or the world is smaller than you think. And Lee thought of that too. That's the thing. By the time we got to the last one, Lee was even able to think of it. So it's like, I don't Yo, know how any ate that team up. No shade. I don't know how any team would not. I, I feel like that, the thought process was literally like, <laughs> the other one seems harder. Like, And that's why everyone went to the break dance. Because definitely, if the teams went to this scribe, they definitely would have been done with this way quicker. Yeah. This would have been a quick-ass thing. And I was thinking, because it is really, well... I want to say it's uneven, but the only people who switched were the ones who were people who chose wall scribe. But it seems like it, it would be an uneven thing. And it made me feel like it was a setup the way the detours were described. Because basically one was described as a puzzle, like a, a brain buster puzzle. You have to look at this big ass mural to figure out. And the other was described as memorize the dance. And it's like one just seemed memorizing the dance just seems easier. So it was a setup. They set y'all ass up made y'all go to that dance and then no one at the dance even thought let's switch because the other one sounded so difficult it just sounded difficult i bet if they're watching back they're probably like no the fuck that's not all they (laughs) They are probably pissed i would because they they really played them played the fuck out of them like what but anyways amber and Vinny and caesar and ricky cesar and ricky both finished very fast and they eat that up and they're done with the detour by the time the other people even get into the other detours like that was so easy. It was very, right. very quick. It was nothing. And that would have been us. That would have been us, girl. It would have been right up there. Honestly, y'all, this season, look. Grant, granted, it's a COVID season, so the shit is easier. And that's the thing. Like, Lee, maybe we should have, we missed our time because last season, <laughs> with uh, last season with Annalee and them, uh uh-uh. uh, that some of that stuff, lot. you remember that lot. big ass dinosaur? They had to go in the cave and build a girl. <laughs> So maybe our time is up. But anyways, <laughs> maybe our time's up. Maybe it made the race decisions for you, sweetheart. <laughs> <laughs> so Ever and Vinny are done. And as they're finished, they're walking past the escalators where you get the first clue. And they see Team Walla Walla and Karishma and Kishore looking very confused because they don't know where the uh, clue is. And so they stop and they they help Team Walla Walla. And their little relationship, Team Walla Walla. Alliance. Versus Amber and Vinny, that's a nasty alliance, and they both in top three. So, hold on. Okay, okay. Walla Walla, they definitely bringing back the old school amazing race of the teams, like having a, a set of alliance, helping each that's other true. out. I live for that, especially because they were in the top three by the end of this. Like alliances really help. Yeah, that's very true. That is very true. I like I like the decisions because Amber and Vinny, it seems like they they're choosing. It seems like they're choosing basically. Like even later on in the episode when they help them again, they're like, okay. We know we have to wait for direction. So while we're waiting, might as well help them. It's like very specific situations. And they're always ahead of them when they're helping right. them, which is another thing. Because so, I will say, I'm yeah. fine with helping somebody I'm ahead of. I sure am. Yeah, like that's fine. So they help Team Walla Walla. And Team Walla Walla decides, because Danny always does these Rebus puzzles anyways, he decided to do it. They were finished very fast as well. And the only other team who decided to do this, other than top three teams, literally... The people who did it were the top three teams. So yeah. note that. So other than them, the only team who decided to do it was Sunny and Busy. So, <sighs> when, but when Sunny and Busy get there, the first world of all, they is start, and we wander. They started at the world. First of all, the the mural. You would think it would go left to right, and I'm well, not. That's how you read say. text. That is how you read text. So they started. On the the image of the world, which is the third clue, so they saw the world and they were like, "Earth, uh, like 
It's G- funny because Globe? Like, it's like for me, <laughs> and a lot of the things it just popped up. Okay, the world, you when you see the mirror. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like I just like like something like the the hand thing. They mm-hmm. were thinking about. They just went so outside of the box. Like the the, the ponder. They said yeah. wander. Wonder wondering what. <laughs> it's like, I think, it, right. I think it's, they like, didn't even have a friend. They were just saying, like, okay, cross hand. Um, like, what? Like, they were just. <laughs> they were just really just. I think they were looking at them individually. But if you go in order, it, to me, it just popped up in my head. It doesn't make sentence structure sense for it to be the globe that is one like wondering like. They were just saying random words and mixing them together. Like when you were just reading them word for word, it just made more sense to say the world. Like I don't know. To me, baby, I'm hilarious. tripping. That really was hilarious. But they were they were just saying anything. I was like, what's happening over there, child? So that was that detour. That was where we would have went, and we would have been done with the with the entire. Girl, we would have been top four in this bitch. We would have ate that up. Sorry. Meanwhile, now, now that Roblox. We'll get there. Thanks Meanwhile, because I think I feel we'll get there. The break dance detour. Mm-hmm. The other people are there. Wanna shame. Yeah, and you know what? Like, like, I still feel like we could have got it. We could have got it. When they I started got on that, when they got on that ground and started the crisscross applesauce. Girl. Girl. And it was going a little fast. I would have been out of breath. You saw how Derek was out there sweating. That would have been me. You had to do it like 50 times if you got it wrong. Now, and that's what I'm saying. The girl, that's the thing. Even if we did chose break dancing, we would have gotten that practice arena. And, and like, we'd have oh, been like, we oh, we're this. switching. We would have been the only other team that switched this episode because if we would have chose break dance in the moment, we were switching. I'd be like, uh-uh. It, it, it seems like, on, I mean, we, obviously the edit is what the edit is. It, did, it seemed like they were practicing for a good minute before they even yep. completed the uh, task. Yeah. And you know what I was thinking? My thought process was, even if the puzzle is hard, I feel like I could figure out the puzzle before either before another team like Sunny and Busy, or well, before be Sunny and Busy, or before or before they could um uh, before they can finish memorizing this routine and getting a check. I was like, even if the puzzle is hard, I feel like I can figure it out. And if I could, this is another thing we would have switched three times like the twins too, if needed be, because if we would have went here first, and oh, we well, too much dip. Hold on. Let me get it out. If we would have went here first and we switched and it was the most difficult puzzle ever, I might have been like, we might need to switch back. Uh-huh. Yeah. I would not want to do that. Like, I just, Luckily, like, I, it wasn't. I, I would feel like we, would, we might as well just take the loss. But I will say, didn't the twins, they, they switched. They switched three times, they actually. Switched back. And then they switched and back. And then they switched the key. That was their problem. Yeah. We wouldn't have done it three. I think, if anything... I'm just saying, if the puzzle was astronomically hard and no one could finish it, the puzzle yeah, was easy yeah. as fuck. Easy so, as fuck. we would have been puzzle? good. Why are they locked? That's not a puzzle. That was not a puzzle. Those were words mixed together with images instead of the word. Like, world, instead, it's the earth, and you didn't know what it was. And it's no shade to people who might not know. <laughs> but I thought it was easy. So, anyways, they're all trying to break dance, learn it. they all struggling for the most part. Um, Charisma Kishore got it pretty fast. Charisma and Kishori were a team that got a pretty fast. They ate that. Mm-hmm. <laughs> That's why I feel like, like literally, to me, it gave Letitia Rod, Juan and Shane, Derek Shalissa, Kishori and Richard, like you mentioned. Yeah. They seem like they completed the task very quickly. I agree. But I agree. they were still so much more behind the top three. And I think it's because the other detour was just that much easier. Like, if you're, yep. if you're able to complete the other detour that much faster, you're definitely probably – who knows how many an hours. hour plus ahead, literally, by the way. Cause it because Rod and Letitia finished, I want to say they were the third team to finish, but they did three, four tries, and every other team was there. So if they did three tries, that means they did three tries and showed it every other team behind them. Cause you have to get back in line and redo it and redo it. So it's like uh, the, clearly that was a lot of time that passed between I'm these stopped, teams. You know, like team. I guess they were probably really intimidated by the like by the other thing, but it, like I said, it did sound who knows on that paper, but it sounded crazy. From it the did, and we got on TV. It definitely did. Korea, and they didn't even say they said Rebus puzzle. I was like, I don't even know where Rebus. I don't even know what that means. What that is? <laughs> so that it did sound scary. It sounded very intimidating, but um, but yeah, um, Sean and Michelle actually finished this one pretty good too. Like hey, I felt like they did hey. a good time too. And it's like, oh, 
because y'all was finishing. Dancing, but... cool. Yeah. So by the time every team is done, Sunny and Busy are still doing the other the other puzzle, and they are not able to get it. They are very much so struggling. They're and coming they, up. They, they were very team. close. They got to the point they were very close, but they yep. were just they were like literally. They said impossible off. or something. Like they the said world is smaller than we think. Than yep. you think that like. Oh, they were, you know what they were saying? They were saying I. I they, instead of you. They were saying I instead of you. So they kept saying I or we. <laughs> the world is smaller than I wonder, or the world is small. And then when they didn't get it, they think in the last word is the word they're messing up on. So they were like, the world is smaller than I than I pondered. The, the world is smaller than I thought. And it's like, no, it's not I, baby. It's you. But hey. It's you, baby. <laughs> and I don't <laughs> Did you hear our new single? Mm-mm. Mm-mm. I heard the CD. I love it. I love it. But anyways. <laughs> <laughs> so everyone finished Sunny and Busy. And Sunny and Busy literally decide to switch detours. And when I tell y'all. I was like, like wow. When I tell y'all, I just knew they lost this game. Girl. I said, they're out. The fact that they're not they're only third to last is crazy. Like, no they're shit. not even. They wasn't even close, actually. Um, so oh, I really God. thought they were out at this. This at is why this I need Kishore sure and Karisha to get it because how can Kishore sure and Karisha pass up Michelle, Melissa, and Yvonne and Busy Girl. and Sunny and still end up second to last? I sure no, get it together. So the roadblock was Lee, it was who's feeling artsy, and, and so you know, for the roadblocks, today. Louise said, um, Louise said, you, you don't get no info on the roadblock, you get two, three sentences, so okay. maybe. It really only said who's feeling artsy. And um, you're feeling artsy, fartsy, babe. Mm-hmm. And I'm feeling artsy. I'm not gonna lie. I feel like even even what it's called, like I, I do a little more artsy stuff. I I feel like neither of us are really artsy, but I do a little more artsy. I stuff will say that does make it harder. That definitely makes it harder. Yeah, but um, so I I guess it would be me. But that's the thing. I'm not going not to toot my own horn. I would flopped. Not so. to toot my own horn. I think I would have ate this up because growing up as a kid. Period. My like mom. Jesus. Yeah, that's gonna be my flash. It's gonna be flashback. It's gonna be pictures of me, and my mom. Okay, so my mom <laughs> and my dad, like they would, um, when I would drive, mm-hmm. they would sometimes make me not use GPS, or yeah. they wouldn't use GPS on purpose. So that's good with navigating, but also it's good with what's it called? Like pe- some people are very bad with knowing where they are relative to other objects, right? Like knowing Great orientation story. and shit. And basically what was most people's problem was not understanding the orientation of the map that they were looking at. And I feel like I would have been able to eat that up because there's been so many times I've just been dropped in a place. When I was a kid, I would go in the woods because I lived oh. in the country. I, I lived in the country. And there was some a wooded area in my backyard. And I would just go in the wood. I didn't have no phone. We, you know, it was back in the day. I would just go in the woods with my I friends. Yes. No. This is what kids did. Like before phone. We don't just stare at the tablet. So, anyways, I would go in the woods and we would like we would go extremely far away from the from like the house. And I would have to, you know, of course, just naturally remember my way so I can get back home. And it was like it was like child, it was easy for me. So I think I would be very good with knowing the orientation. And that's what a lot of people were struggling with for real. They're like, well, which direction are we? And that's why Sunny and Busy I would have That's why Sunny and Busy caught up because son, whoever was doing it. They were able to find the orientation so fast that that's why they passed up the other three teams. And it's like, damn, y'all look ate that up. I think. Girl, and if it was me, we you, we were lost. This I'm right there with Michelle. Oh baby, we were right there with Michelle. Hopefully uh, ahead of Michelle because the the time jump between yeah, I, was, I, didn't and the, Michelle, I didn't even get the rules. Please. So the rules were, you had to, you had to. Um, <laughs> There are statues are all around this area near this museum. And you you have to find the name of the statue and match it up on the map you have to the orientation of where it is relative to the museum, basically. You wouldn't eat that up. You wouldn't eat that up. I feel like well then honestly, gladly, I think I would have just ended up taking this roadblock. Because I think I would have did good. Whew. Thank God. Or at least, honestly, better than these last four teams. The last four teams were struggling. And Shalisa was kind of struggling. It, it seemed like it was pretty hard. When t- t- they really started to, they had to work together with this one. And yeah. I didn't understand why Michelle really was 
asking for help? Girl, she I, did ask. She did. She did ask. It oh, was I so. It was. Tea. It was funny because what happened was so Amber and Vinny got there. Ricky and uh, Cesar got there, and they both ended up finishing pretty pretty quickly on their own. And when they finished. Amber and Vinny finished first. Caesar and Ricky was right behind them. And Amber and Vinny was like, it's going to take us a long time to get um, directions. So let's just help Angie and Danny, who was right there as well. So they went, they literally was telling Angie and Danny, this one's here, this one's there, this one's there, which I love. That's why you need to have an alliance, girl. Exactly. And behind them was Rod and Letitia and Juan and Shane. They pulled up at the exact same time. And Shane and Rod were doing it. And they were like, you do six, I do six. and Shane was finding his, but he didn't know the orientation. But Rod knew the orientation, so okay. he was helping. He was helping Shane figure that out. So they really did help each other very well. And what I saw was it was a very quick scene, so it's easy that you missed it. Michelle was behind them, or she was on the other side of them, and she walked up and she said, uh, "Can you guys help me? Because I don't know." And Rod walked right in front of her and like blocked her a little bit. From 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 talking to them, and she just went back, and she didn't really ask again. And it's like she tried a oh, little bit. Uh, 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 just... wow. So he didn't it help her. In the race sometimes. He didn't help her. It and is. He was like tunnel vision. He didn't. He didn't hear her or something. I think that's what it was a little bit because it didn't seem like honestly, it didn't seem like he heard her. She was kind of more talking to Shane, and then he kind of just got in the way, and he was like helping Shane, and they were working together. But like, he should have worked with Karishma and Kishori or something. Like she should have worked with somebody else. Something you could have tried something else. It, but, was, um, it didn't work. Needed a partner to run through this, unless you have Cesar Ricky. <laughs> Clearly. So um, yeah, Wanda Shane and Letitia Rod ended up finishing around the same time. When Wanda Shane finished, um, Rod got a check and he got it wrong. And he was like, "Hold on, y'all, don't leave yet." <laughs> and he pulled Shane back over there, and Shane uh, corrected him. So that was cute. So they ended up finishing um quickly, and then Shalisa, Derek were after them, and then it was just the last three teams. And then Sunny and Busy finally finished their detour. They pulled up and they finished before the other three teams. They ate that up. Just that fast. Ate that, ate up. that up. One of them was like, I'm an artist, but she was like, I didn't, I don't remember who was doing it. I really don't. I want to say busy. But anyways, she's an artist, so that's why she chose to do it. But it's not even like art or anything, but she was still able to eat it up. So it was like, okay, clearly doing art has something to do with it. You art. Yeah, but like I guess finding where they are ain't got shit to do with painting or making it. <laughs> um, and she was like, yeah, I did not think it was going to be this, but hey, we're good. But she still ate it up. And so it left um, at the back of the pack, Karishma, Kachori, and Michelle and Sean. And then <sighs> Karishma got it first. So it just Michelle and Sean just lost. But honestly, a part of me is like, okay with that because it didn't seem like they was finna eat it up. They didn't seem well, like unfortunately, they started off really, really well. I just think they kept getting into like these small mistakes a little bit, but I did feel like generally they were pretty good at some of these um, these challenges. Yeah, honestly, they were. I, I did like them. There was very specific ones where it's like, y'all did so good there. It's like they kept getting, like you said, little mistakes. And it was so cute because at the end of the episode, when they finally finished. They let them finish. They didn't go stop them. Like sometimes right. Phil will meet them at the place. <laughs> they let them finish. And when they finally finished, um, and Phil let them know they were losing, he like asked them to do the double dutch for them. That was so a cute thing. The that was such a cute dutch. thing. And they left it. They did. kept it in. That was so fun. I love that ending. That was great. Cause it's like, yay, like y'all lost, but y'all still yay. Enjoyed your time. So it was cute. That was cute episode or whatever. Um, would have been better at 45 minutes. Let's re yeah, let's wrap that back up. Definitely, 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 definitely. But no, it it was fine. I mean, we'll be here next next week, regardless. Seems like next week there's gonna be more bickering because they're driving. So that'll I'm be. I I love self driving legs. That'll be very interesting. So tune in next week for that. Um, we're also covering Big Brother Canada. So if you're into that, tune into that. Even if you're not into it, watch us. Thank you. And we're also going live after every Survivor episode on Wednesday. So check that out as well. And thank you for keeping it real with the kingdom. We out, boo. Period.